From Cincinnati, Ohio, you're watching American Baseball on ESPN. Getting ready to play two games today at UC Baseball Stadium as Butler and Cincinnati wrap up their three-game weekend series. The leadoff man after getting ahead 0-2, and he picks up his first strikeout there, tying up Parks on the insides. But yesterday we saw they were coming up swinging. Well, they're swinging and missing right now. Horst with two strikeouts in the second inning. Action clock is in effect. Good slider. Dorigi chases it for strike three. Swing and a miss. Talked about Max Paul Mary. I know the Bearcats are waiting for him to come back. Strike three called inside corner. Hageman comes through. Line drive to left for a base hit. Gidry scores. They hold Klingenbeck at third, but the Bearcats finally get on the board in the fourth. They're not being granted timeouts in the box, so they need to be ready to go. Urban wasn't ready to go there. Another strikeout for Horst. Baseball number one team in the country and Baseball America number one team in the country. So, Strikeout for Horst there. His second of the inning. Seventh of the ball game. Big pitch here, the one-two. Couple hops up the middle into center for a base hit. Harding from third. Springer from second. Gidry stays hot. Two runs single to tie the game. Here we go, big pitch here, 3-2. Hegeman, line drive, right center. This ball is down. He comes through again. Both runners score. Bearcats take the lead. Josh Hageman, man, he just keeps fouling pitches, fouling pitches, and he finally got a pitch he can drive low. From Cincinnati, Ohio, you're watching American Baseball on ESPN. It's the second game of the doubleheader between Butler and Cincinnati. Winner of this one, he'll take the series. Vitterick up the middle. Well played at short, Dorigi takes it. High throw, Parks holds the bag and a collision at first. Fortunately, everyone's okay, but Vitterick does drive in the run. Brooks scores from third to put Cincinnati on the scoreboard especially being a freshman down there. It's gonna lead to some runs. Nicholson shoots it the other way. Hugis from third. Hegeman gets the wave around. Bearcats take the lead. Nicholson, two run single. And that's Ryan Nicholson that we've talked about. You put the big shift on him. Big boy will go the opposite way. 103 off the bat, scores two. The Bearcats take the lead, three to two. Harding gets jammed. But trouble behind second, long way to go. Wirch drops it in and out of the glove. Nicholson around from second, Harding into second. He trades places. Put your thinking cap on or your thinking glasses. Whoa. Uh oh. Deep fly to right, spawn seller yeah. underneath it. That ball's going to carry, carry, and way gone. Look out, big O. Spawn seller on loads. Little breathing room for the Bearcats. 89 mile an hour fastball that JP Sponsauer just absolutely turns on and crushes. No doubt in the right field. Almost landed on the big Oscar Robinson statue outside of Fifth Third Arena. Puts the Bearcats up six to three, JP Sponsauer. Watch this, Anthony. Think he knew it was gone? Yep. Mm. Have four catchers on the roster. And it's going to lead to more runs. Opposite shot for Hugis. Two run score, and the ball gets by the catcher. Hugis to second on the throw. Two run single for Griffin Hugis. Whoa, oh, that boy. ball is demolished. Wow. See ya. Almost on top of the roof, Landon Vitterick. 105 off the bat, 419 feet for this freshman. Two run job, Landon Vitterick. That change up, that hung baby, and he paid. Wow. Right off the bat, no question. Yeah, and when we talked about J.P. Sponseller watching, 
2-2. Brooks sends it out to right center. DeFreeze on the move. Van Leer out of his reach. They won't get to that one. Brooks rounding second. Both runners score. Relay to third. Late. RBI triple. Brings home two for Loudon Brooks. Josh Harrison. Ground ball to short. This should end it. Guidry. Low throw. Good scoop by Nicholson to officially end the ball game. Big win for Cincinnati in game three. And after Butler won game two in the doubleheader earlier today, Bearcats win the series finale.